Hey, this is Sigourney here, and today I'll bring you guys Ghoul's Weekly Recap for the week of October 5th, 2015, guys. Let's jump into this. Hopefully, you guys are feeling much better than I am. You may be able to hear in my voice, maybe not. It's kind of clearing up. I'm pretty much better now. Uh, but yeah, the reason for no videos lately is because I've actually been pretty ill. Well, not, not really that. I just had a cold, basically, right? Call me a pussy if you like. I don't give a shit. It, it's still... Horrible being ill, nonetheless, right? So, <coughs> I do apologize. I pretty much, I just had a cold, right? Um, you know, runny nose, just feeling tired, sore throat, all that kind of stuff. So that's why there hasn't been videos. I, I couldn't really commentate. I could barely commentate now because, uh, you know, I, I just want to cough every, like, five seconds. But I wanted to inform you guys in case you don't follow me on Twitter and all that kind of stuff. Like I said, it has pretty much cleared up now. The uh, tiredness and, like, the kind of, you know, just, like, blocked up nose is pretty much gone. It's pretty much just a sore throat now, just... Uh, <laughs> just uh, very kind of, you know, it, it just tickles at the back of my throat, which is a bit annoying, but it should be fully gone, hopefully, by tomorrow, and then I can, you know, get back on the video train. See, I do apologize for no content, but I'm not going to make, you know, videos whilst I'm ill. I just wanted to focus on getting be better, and I'm sure you guys don't want to hear me, you know, struggling to commentate whilst I'm, you know, coughing all over the place and, like, sniffing, and, you know, it, it just wouldn't have been a nice experience, so... Yeah, there you go. This will probably also be quite a short recap today just because, you know, I, I don't know how long I could go before. I'm just going to absolutely kill my throat. So, uh, yeah, there you go. That's why there's been any content, but don't worry. Uh, I'm pretty much good now. So, um, you know, you, you'll start seeing regular videos once again. I haven't, I haven't gone anywhere permanently or anything like that. I am, or I will soon be returning so look forward to some more content very very soon uh yeah um whilst i was ill which was kind of unfortunate because i wanted to record lots and lots and lots of videos in it uh was the rainbow six siege beta i was lucky that they extended it they extended it twice firstly they extended it till october 1st um which was lucky because i didn't even get my code until um you know like a few days before october 1st so i i only had like two days to play or something like that and then they extended it again um till october 4th i believe till sunday so that gave me a bit extra time to play it and uh also allowed my friends to jump on board and we played together and that was a lot of fun it's definitely a very teamwork heavy game um but yeah yeah it's a lot of fun playing with them so yeah, that did suck that I was ill that whole kind of time because I didn't really, you know, I, I wanted to record loads of like gore plays and, you know, just all those kind of videos in it and get plenty of content for you guys um, in case you was interested in Rainbow Six Siege. But unfortunately, I wasn't really able to do that. I, I did manage to get the first part of gore plays um, down on, ra on the Rainbow Six Siege closed beta, which hopefully you guys have seen. If not, there will be a link in the description if you want to check that video out. But yeah, I, I, I tried to do part two and I, I just wasn't feeling it. I, I got worse as the beta went on, unfortunately. But oh well, I do have some content of just like my friends and I just chilling out playing the game. Um, so I probably sift through that footage at some point and, you know, kind of cut that together and maybe get some funny mo- There was definitely some funny shit going on there, so I'll try to cut that together and show you guys that. Um, but I think I got like three hours worth of footage to sit through, so that may take quite a while to, um, you know, hit my channel, but it will surface eventually, hopefully before the game comes out. Don't worry, it'll definitely be here by December 1st, that'll be okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> Beta was a lot of fun. Uh, if you want to hear more of my opinion of that and all that kind of stuff, you should check out the podcast. That's where I mainly talk about that stuff now. The BritBox podcast is a show I do with my best friend, Max. If you haven't seen it, there's two episodes out already. We do it every week. We record it every Wednesday, and then it goes up every Friday. It's about a 30-minute podcast show. And, uh, yeah, I'm really enjoying that, actually. Hopefully, you guys are as well. And, um, yeah, yeah, that, that's what I'm going to be talking about, you know, like my opinions on games and stuff like that. I'm going to save these videos now, the, these Goals Weekly Recap videos, to just um, focus on, like, video-specific stuff or, you know, from going places or from ill and stuff like that. Um, you know, basically stuff I just tweet on Twitter, although, of course, not... All of you following me on Twitter, which uh, I understand that is fair enough, so I need to put it in video form as well. So that's what these videos are kind of for. And uh, yeah, that being said, uh, there's not too much to talk about today. I did want to make this a short one so I don't absolutely strain my throat and, you know, just stuff like that. Uh, there will be... I've talked about more content 
come to the channel and new ideas and stuff like that. I know I've been very kind of off and on with like the commentary form of content. Uh, I did one a little while ago called Don't Spam on YouTube, um, which was very well received actually, which is very nice. I did like the kind of style I went for with that commentary. So I'm probably going to do more like that. There's a lot of things I want to talk about. I've learned a lot about the rights and wrongs of YouTube, if you will, um, you know, just over the past few months or, yeah, I don't know, just, just, <clears throat> I've been listening to a big inspiration of mine, I talked about him plenty of times before, so you guys are probably familiar with uh, his name at least, Total Biscuit, he's a massive YouTube inspiration to me, and I've been listening to a lot of his podcasts, that's what kind of inspired me to start the Britbox podcast, was listening to his podcast, the Co-Optional podcast, um, but I went back and started listening to, like, the very old stuff, um, which uh, is the Game Station podcast, that was before he, like, renamed it and stuff like that. But we, I don't need to go into specifics in case you guys aren't a fan of his stuff, uh, but yeah, basically, you know, just hearing like these bigger YouTubers talk about, you know, just, just giving advice and stuff like that on these shows. And I don't know, I, I just think I've learned a lot of lessons and stuff. And I think I've learned ways to improve my channel. And that's kind of like the type of topics I want to commentate about and kind of show some of you guys that maybe, you know, aren't exposed to those kind of that advice and stuff like that and uh, kind of help you guys out as well. So that, that'll be in the form of commentaries, which will be coming very soon. I also plan to start doing some dual commentaries, maybe on those topics, maybe just on other kind of silly stuff with some other YouTubers. So that'd be good. Look forward to that as well. And of course, there will be other series stuff, which I have noted down. I still need to put the full kind of schedule in place. Um, you know, being ill kind of screwed that up. And of course, having the beta kind of screwed that up as well, because I just wanted to play that as uh, that was a lot of fun. Um, but yeah, yeah, I've definitely got um, plenty of content planned. So don't worry, guys. There, there will be some new stuff hitting the channel soon, which hopefully... Uh, you will enjoy as much as the other stuff that's going on at the moment. I know we're a bit all over the place at the moment, but things will be ironed out very, very soon. But that being said, guys, that is pretty much it for today. Let's wrap things up as usual with video of the week. And it have to be Gore Plays Rainbow Six Siege. Like I said, I did manage to get that video out before I became, you know, before I hit the peak of illness. So, uh, yeah, definitely go check that video out. One thing I just wanted to add is... And another reason for there not being content was uh, also I was having tr trouble with my PC. I forgot to write this in the notes. Completely forgot about this. Uh, basically, over like the past month or so, I've been having a lot of trouble with my computer um, in the way of it just randomly shutting itself down and restarting with like no warning, which uh, of course was very annoying when you're recording a video Gore plays Rainbow Six Siege Part 2, for instance, uh, you record the first game of that and then it suddenly just cuts off and you lose all your footage, which is a bit annoying. And, you know, just other stuff like that when you're editing a video or trying to render out a video. I rendered out the BritBox podcast episode 2 about three times, I think, because it just, you know, it just got cut off multiple times from my PC, shutting down. Fingers crossed I fixed it, basically, you know... After getting quite annoyed with, you know, I, I looked up loads of stuff trying to find fixes and stuff like that. Uh, you know, I tried, you know, like dif reinstalling different drivers or di disabling stuff and stuff like that. Um, in the end, I literally just, you know, like unplugged my PC, opened it up and uh, basically just... Uh, unplugged everything from the power supply and basically just dusted the whole thing out and then replugged everything into the power supply just to make sure, you know, everything was, all the cables were plugged in fully, um, which, you know, fingers crossed, touch wood, um, you know, has fixed it. It hasn't crashed since, which has been pretty surprising. I didn't actually think that would fix it. I just thought, you know, uh, I might as well try it and I might as well just you know, dust out my PC, because I haven't dusted it out since I built it, which was like six months ago, um, but yeah, hopefully, hopefully I fixed it, it hasn't crashed since, which has been awesome, uh, so yeah, that was a reason, another reason for no content, just getting super frustrated with that, and then having to spend half the day trying to, you know, figure out what's wrong with my computer, and, you know, fixing it, and stuff like that, so yeah, hopefully that doesn't happen again, if it does, then I may have to get a new power supply, that is probably going to be the most likely culprit, but so far, things seem to be going okay, Okay. Anyway, video of the week, I was talking about Gore's, Gore, <coughs> I apologise, Gore plays Rainbow Six Siege Part 1, or pro it's probably going to be the only part to be fair, but there will be more 
Six Siege gameplay with my friends, like I mentioned. Here's a preview, click the annotation or the link in the description or the notification to go check it out. Let's push around to the right first. There we go. Usually someone camped there. Most of them are probably going to be to the left now. Let's get a grenade in there just in case. Kind of cover my back while I check around here. Oh, that motherfucker. No, 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 no. Ah, through the door. Did I, did I juke him? I actually juked him by going through that little hole. So hopefully you guys did enjoy that video if you have seen it. If not, like I said, go check it out. I'm sure you will enjoy it. And it also gives you a little taste of Rainbow Six Siege. And maybe if you want to pick it up or not. Anyway, guys, on to comment of the week before we wrap things up. It'd have to be my comment, surprisingly. You're probably like, what, Josh, you greedy bastard. You're meant to feature our comments. Why are you being such a shameless whore? Look, okay, I, I I just wanted to feature this comment. I know it's from me, but there, there's some information in there that I wanted to share with you guys. A lot of you don't follow me on Twitter, like I said before, uh, and a lot of you guys wouldn't have seen this comment, so I, I just wanted to share it with you guys. Um, this also kind of links into some of the topics I want to talk about with, like, the YouTube advice and stuff like that. But anyway, ju just listen, and you'll, you'll kind of get what I'm talking about. So this was... A reply to somebody asked well somebody saying that nobody wants to watch a 30 plus minute video uh, referring to Britbox podcast episode number two which you know is fair enough that's their opinion but here you go this is my reply so thanks for your feedback but I disagree with you I'm getting similar view counts on this type of content to any of my other recent videos I'm getting around the same amount of likes telling me that people do wish to watch this content or this new form of content. If this is not what you or others subscribe for, then don't watch these types of videos. Alternatively, if I'm no longer producing the content that you wish to watch and you don't like where my channel is heading, then feel free to unsubscribe. For one, I'm a variety channel, so I'm not just going to play one game or make one type of content. And two, I make content I wish to make because that's what I enjoy making. I don't necessarily make it to try and get lots of views if that's not the videos I am compelled to create. For example, I used to mainly focus on just Call of Duty information videos. They would get a good amount of views on average, possibly even more than my current videos get. However, making that form of content was not really compelling to me, so I stopped and moved on to more entertaining forms of content, as that's the direction. I wish for my channel to be heading. I don't know about you, but I create YouTube videos because I enjoy making YouTube videos. It's great if they get lots of views or if I gain loads of subscribers from them, but at the end of the day, if you're not having fun doing so, then what's the point? There's no way to predict if my channel will ever be really successful. It could take years, I could blow up overnight, or it may never happen at all. At the end of the day, I'm not going to spend hours and hours recording and editing videos if that's not what puts a smile on my face. Hopefully you can respect that. Have a good day, the Goronator. So, yeah, basically there, that, that, I, I took quite a while to come up with that response, but... All that is completely true. I make videos because I enjoy making videos. That is the type of content I create. And if you're a fellow content creator out there, I encourage you to make the videos that you want to make and that no one else wants you to make, okay? If your fans are telling you to make a type of video that you don't necessarily want to make, don't make it just to please them, okay? Make the videos you want to make. I know that sounds harsh, but, you know, just hear me out, right? Make the videos as a content creator that you want to make, that you enjoy creating, and the audience will come to you. Don't worry about trying to, you know, please a certain audience. You make the content and the fans will come to you, I promise you. They will come and they, if they enjoy your content, they will subscribe for that, okay? Don't try and please everybody because that's never, that's never going to work, guys. You can never please everybody, okay? That, that, that's something I'll definitely talk about in depth a bit more in a commentary, uh, but I just wanted to share that with you guys just to kind of let you know where my thoughts are at with that kind of stuff. But anyway, guys, that is pretty much it for today. Holy crap, that was a 15 minute long commentary. I just want to cough so bad right now. I'm trying to hold it in as I wrap this up. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it as always. Please do have a great rest of your week and of course, I'll see you guys next time. Hopefully when I'm feeling a bit better. Bye. Motherfucker behind the thing. All right. Well, watch out. There's a thing there. She could have walked into that very easily. So that was good. Sometimes they're out here. Might want to check this. Just in case there's three enemies left. There they are.